On the right-hand side of Rome's Basilica of St. Mary Major, there's a true treasure that's often described as another Sistine Chapel. It dates back to the 16th century, when for years the original paintings were covered. Then in 1870, Pius IX ordered the frescoes to be covered with lighter colors. It's a practice that experts say was quite common during that time period. The Pope intervened with a decoration. He called for everything that was white or black to be changed to a golden color. Things were made simpler with this change. Back then it was something done when improvements were needed. And now those who come and visit the Basilica can admire what was actually hidden behind its very walls. More than 25,000 square feet that show a painting technique that combines light and dark shades. In the last 150 years, we have mostly tempera paintings. Almost the entire surface, almost 70% is covered with colors that were added in the 1800s. This process was quite common, but in this case, it was more of a re-elaboration. The restoration is led by the director of the Vatican Museums. In fact, in the last five years, the process has involved more than 10 specialists. At first, the frescoes were analyzed in the lab to identify its original source. And experts say the result is truly a visual treat. What we see now, so this blue and yellow tone and this historical lighting was changed. So it was followed by other green, yellow and red tones. The walls were completely covered by another type of red, which had made the fresco lose its unique shine. The Basilica of St. Mary Major is a historical relic from the 5th century. And it's the only one out of Rome's four papal basilicas that still has its original Christian floor plan. And so, with its stunning mosaics and impressive proportions, it has truly survived the test of time, making it a true testimony of sacred art in Rome.